Go right here, so you stay very loose. Is my child too young for the COVID-19 vaccine? Is it safe? Does it work? As the US Food and Drug Administration considers authorizing the Pfizer vaccine for five to 11 year olds, here's what you need to know about the vaccine for children. All done. Yay. You're very good. When will they roll out? The Pfizer vaccine has been available in the US to kids aged 12 to 15 since May. The shots for 5 to 11 year olds are likely to be available early November. Where will the shots be available? Depending on the state, it could be in pediatricians' offices, pharmacies and schools. Is it the same vaccine as the adult one? Yes, but at a lower dose. Pfizer and BioNTech have asked for authorization of a 10 microgram dose of the vaccine. That's a third of the dose size given to people 12 and older. The vaccine is still a two-shot vaccine, with doses given around three weeks apart. Can you still use the children's dose on a small five-year-old or a big 11-year-old? The dose is based on age and not weight, according to Brittany Kamush, who's an epidemiologist and professor at Syracuse University. She says the vaccine dosing strategy has more to do with the maturity of the immune system rather than weight or metabolism. Is it safe? Safety data from more than 3,000 children who received the vaccine in Pfizer's 4,500 participant clinical trial was generally comparable to that for 16 to 25 year olds. The most common side effects for children included fever, headaches and chills, which were generally reported less frequently and milder than for 12 to 15 year olds. Both the Pfizer-BioNTech and Moderna vaccines have been linked to rare cases of heart inflammation called myocarditis, especially in young men. Still, Pfizer suggests that the rate of myocarditis in the age group is likely to be lower than observed in vaccinated 12 to 15 year olds due in part to the lower dose. Does it work? Pfizer and BioNTech said in September that their COVID-19 vaccine induced a robust immune response in the 5 to 11 year olds in its clinical trial. And that for this age group, the vaccine showed 90.7% efficacy against the disease. But why bother? If children are less likely to get seriously ill from COVID, why bother vaccinating them? Pediatric vaccination is a public health tool to prevent infectious diseases, even ones that do not have high rates of mortality or hospitalization in children. Children in the US already receive vaccines for illnesses that have similar or lower levels of related mortality in kids, like hepatitis A, chickenpox, rubella, and rotavirus.